Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, hello, my name is Vivian. Today is going to be another vlog, as you can tell from the title of this video. Um, it's going to be a very busy day today because I just finished my very first in-person booth event for three days at the 626 night market in the Bay Area in Pleasanton, California. So it was my very first time doing the in-person booth event. I sold a bunch of squishy toys, my plushies, uh, we also had stickers, keychains, and other kawaii items. I will insert some video and pictures from that event. Unfortunately, I didn't really have time to vlog on the day of. Um, it was also kind of stressful in terms of prepping everything because I didn't know what to expect. But overall, it was such a fun experience. And I'm so happy to be able to meet some of you guys that were able to come by and say hi and support my booth as well. So thank you so, so much for coming to support your girl. And definitely after this event, I will love to do more in-person booths because I really think it's super fun. Um, it is tiring at some point because it is um, a lot of traveling and packing, but everyone is so, so nice. I've met so many amazing people. Um, my vendor neighbors were super nice and so supportive as well. So definitely something that I will be looking forward to in the future. In other exciting news, and I'm really late to posting on this, but I just launched my plush Kickstarter. I'm just going to show you guys a brief overview on camera on what they look like. Um, I do have pictures posted on the Kickstarter page, but here is an official video for these. Um, I haven't done a very good job at promoting them, so I just want to show you. So this is Vivi Bear, as you know, one of my mascots for Cinder Cake. Uh, she is a fluffy bear, obviously, and it's named after me because my name is Vivian, so I want it to be Vivi Bear. Um, she has a giant bow with polka dots, and her eyes are my favorite part of the design because it's so, so detailed and so dreamy. Um, her dress is a silk-like material with some lace trim around the ends of the dress and it's also velcro at the back so you can actually dress her up um, into any outfit that you would like. Um, she has a little small tail and embroidery on her feet and her face um, along with her ears. What's so special about Vivi Bear is that she actually has a four magnet attachment to the hand and face. So her main pose is with her arms on her face like that, but you can actually move it and it's uh, magnetic here, which is really cool. Um, she has a deep rose fur texture and everything like that, and she is um, about 10 inches tall. So there she is. So there's Vivi Bear. The second character that I'm going to introduce you is Sweetie Sheba, and Sweetie Sheba is her companion, Vivi Bear's companion. Um, there's a little story um, about these characters that I posted on my website. If, we, if you also want to read more about it, it'll be in the link below. Um, so Sweetie Sheba also has a giant bow with a uh, mint green and purple ombre with silk, silk screen printing on po the polka dots. Um, embroidery as well. She has a plastic nose. There you go. So very, very detailed. I'm so happy with how these came out. Um, her fur is a different fur texture than her physical body. It's more fluffy and soft. And she also has a little heart charm. So there it is. Um, and embroidery on the paws as well. We gotta include the toe beans because the toe beans are the best part of the dog, I think. Um, here is her tail. And she also has a butthole. A lot of you guys really wanted a charm mark for her, kind of like Pom Pom Pierden from the Sanrio characters, how he has like a little butthole, but Sweetie Sheba also has a butthole as well. So <laughs> there she is. She's also 10 inches tall, so these are available on Kickstarter. If you would like to adopt these, please do so. It would really mean the world to me to be able to make these um, come to life. Um, and for you guys to add them to your plush collection. So if there's any questions, please feel free to email me or DM me on Instagram. Everything will be in the description box below. So, yay! <laughs> I also took the time to clean my desk in my room, and if you've seen my previous video, I actually received this table from FlexiSpot, and I absolutely love it because you can actually elevate and lower the table as you need. 
I will leave a link to this table in the description box below. They also come with different colors and styles of tables, which you can check on their website. But other than that, I love this very much. Um, they also sent me a wonderful office chair. I actually gifted this to my boyfriend because I know he's been looking for one and that he games a lot. So I was trying to find a chair that would really fit his needs and he absolutely loves this one. The headrest is also adjustable and along with the height of the chair as well. This material is great because sometimes when you're gaming too much you can often be sweaty and luckily this chair does not absorb heat. This chair is also perfect for him or for anyone else because it actually has a pretty wide back area which my boyfriend obviously needs because he does go to the gym a lot and here's him enjoying his chair. I will also leave the link to this chair in the description box below if you would like to get one for yourself. All right, I'm going to be unboxing some of the new album squishies that came in the mail and I'm also gonna put them in the drawers after, but I wanted to unbox it with you guys because I'm really excited for these. <laughs> One. You can't even see it yet, but we got the new album squishies. These are the mini Mike Pan, um, I guess you can say bread heads. Um, and then these are the mini Marmo crepes. As you can see, this is what they look like. I will do close-ups of them very soon. Um, yeah, we got these in. They're so cute. So this first one is Amy, and Amy is one of the OG Mike Pan uh, colorways that I would release. She is a Calico uh, cat. Calico. <laughs> I was thinking of a, of a snack. I was thinking of a cal Calico snack. Oh my gosh, okay. Calico cat, which is like an orange-brown uh, pattern. And these are super soft and slow rising. They're also very textured, as you can see. And they have toe beans. Look how cute that is. But um, they all have the names on the back as well. But super cute. So here's the first one. The second design is Letty. And Letty is also one of the OG or original character designs for the Mike Pan series and she is a chocolate mint color um, and scent. She also smells like chocolate mint. So there's that one. Three of my favorite colors in one squishy. What? This one's name is Sugar, which is super cute. So if you didn't know, my three favorite colors are pink, blue, and purple. Um, so I love that they made it into this. So adorable. This one smells like berries. So as you can see, it is super, super textured. Um, it's actually quite thick too, width-wise. And look how squishy it is. The purple matches my nails. And the toe beans. And the back is... um toasted or baked color. Look at how slow writing this is. Oh, it smells so good. So these are the three colors that you can get. Next up are the mini Marmo crates. Oh my gosh, I love the size of these. So if you didn't know, iBloom actually released a regular jumbo version of these and now they newly released the mini versions. And I actually think I like this size much better. Um, super cute and petite. So there are four colors to collect. Let me see if I can balance it on here. There we go. So four colors of these are available. This first one is Yumi Kawa Soda. I don't know what that means, but I believe it's a soda flavored or scent or design. Um, but it does have a pink and blue colorway on it. This is one of the pretty designs that I like. This one is the OG Strawberry. So you can see it's like pink 
so strawberry. Here is the matcha one. I love matcha. Matcha is also known as green tea. Um, this one specifically is called matcha kinako. And lastly, we have the vanilla flavor. So vanilla has the vanilla ice cream. So with these ones, I'm assuming the soda one is the blue ice cream on here since they do all have strawberry, but I think the designs are named off of the ice cream on the crepes. All right, here is the first one. Oh my goodness. This color is so beautiful. So this one has like a lavender um, on it. And this one also has a paper crepe. So if you don't know, crepes are like really nice desserts. They come in savory and sweet, but this is a sweet crepe. Um, and they always come with a paper wrap. Sometimes you can get ice cream or whipped cream, as you can see here, along with some fruits. Um, so here is the soda design. This one has the blue ice cream. I love this one so much. This one smells like strawberry. Yeah, I think these the names are based off of the ice cream. So here I have three bags of squishies. Um, full of them. Of These are the ones that were left over and I'm just going to go ahead and organize them all in the drawers over here. This next pre-order I'm packing is for G, and she just got a Doraemon squishy mascot. This is her packing slip, postcards, and I'm also going to give her a Sanrio trinket in her package as well. The next pre-order is for Jessie, and she got the Galaxy Cloud post-it note, a Vivi Vera sitting down sticker, and a Shiba Boba sticker as well. And I'm actually going to pack this. She also got a Shiba Boba acrylic pin. And I'm going to include a little trinket for her. She also got the Hello Kitty Doraemon Shared Red Squishies, two pink ones, and one red one. Packing slip and postcards. This next one is for Gina, and she got the teal fawn squishy. 
the Misty Pink Angel Cat Squishy. And she also got a Vivi Bear Circle acrylic pin. The postcard. And then I'm also going to give her a trinket as well. sticker okay next one is for amy and she got a doraemon squishy mascot squishy i said that twice she got a doraemon squishy mascot and a cinder cake rainbow notepad i'm also going to include a trinket for her and my postcards All right, next package is for Cassandra, and she got the Galaxy Luke Harajuku Bear Squishy. She also got the purple one, the new Sakura Kit Kats, Shirokuma Mini Toast Squishy, and two of my glitter enamel pins going to include a trinket and my postcards. This next one is for Claudia and she got the extra barbecue Lay's chips, the purple Harajuku Bear squishy mascot, the Luke design, the new Kit Kat Raspberry, and my Vivi Bear enamel pins. I'm also going to give her a trinket and my postcards. 